Morgan from BadassTraining.com, and today I'm going to answer another one of your questions. Brittany wants to know, how do you eat clean on a budget? And a lot of people ask me that all the time, and I actually personally kind of have a problem with the phrase clean eating, because it can mean a whole bunch of things. Clean eating can mean vegan or vegetarian or low carb, low fat, you know, what is clean eating? So I'm going to define clean eating for you guys uh, based on what I think it is. So to me, I think clean eating is eating in a way that is unprocessed and eating foods as close to their natural whole state as you can. So how do you start clean eating? First off, I think it's best to make slow changes rather than trying to change your diet completely overnight. When you try to change everything all at once, not only is it really, really difficult to do, because you're probably not accustomed to eating just raw things or whole vegetables and your taste buds really haven't acclimated, but you can also harm your body. Because physiologically, you don't do well just changing your diet overnight. You actually release a bunch of toxins when you start to change your diet, and when you do it very quickly, you can overload your bloodstream with toxins and you can have all kinds of bad side effects from doing that. So the best way to change your diet is slowly. Secondly, I would recommend starting simple. A lot of people try to get really crazy with their clean eating recipes and stuff like that right from the jump and that makes it really confusing because you kind of lose track of what clean eating is exactly and like I said, it's eating foods in their whole state, eating foods in their natural state. So I'd, what I would recommend when you first start clean eating is to just find your local farmer's market go in, purchase things like fresh fruits, fresh vegetables, whole grains, and lean meats, and just play around with cooking those basic items minimally. So try to use as little oil as you can, add no sugars, use minimal seasoning, and just get to know what basic whole foods taste like. Um, clean eating really isn't difficult. It's a very easy way of living, and you can be as complex or as minimal with it as you can. One thing that clean eating will cost you is time. It takes a little bit more of your time to prepare and wash and cook and even eat clean food than it does processed food. It's not something you can just pop in the microwave. Um, but one way to save time when you're trying to clean or eat clean is purchasing your fruits and vegetables and produce and stuff and washing it, packaging it, and refrigerating it immediately. If you wait or if you keep it in those plastic baggies that it comes in when you purchase produce, it goes bad really quickly and it's also kind of a pain in the butt to add an extra step in your preparation when you're making your food. So in short, when you're trying to switch over to a clean eating diet, remember, be gradual and easy on yourself, minimalistic, and when you're trying to save money, Buy the whole food, go to your farmer's markets, shop around and get good deals, and also to save time, make sure that you wash your vegetables and prepare everything all at once rather than doing it bit by bit. I hope that this video has been helpful to you and that you can get started on your clean eating diet and become healthier. Thank you for watching my video and don't forget to check out my website at www.badashtraining.com for more tips about healthy living.